Hey, what's going on guys? Ben here and today I'm super excited to be checking out the brand new iPhone 12 mini. So without further ado, let's just jump right on into the box. See, my favorite thing about the iPhone 12 mini is just how easy this device is to hold. I mean, it's so tiny that you can really reach every corner of the screen. It is not a trouble at all. And I'm 5'7", and I've been using the iPhone 12 Pro for a while, and the 12 Pro is in a big phone. They actually make the 12 Pro Max, which is even bigger, and I still have to use this O-Snap grip on the back of my phone just to be able to hold it more easily and be able to actually reach the corners. And so to have something that I don't have to put in a case or I don't have to put some sort of pop socket or grip on to be able to actually reach everywhere on the screen is such a huge relief. It actually reminds me back of the old iPhone 5S where that phone was so easy to hold, so small, and was so nice to use. And Apple did a really good job of making sure that the smaller screen didn't actually inhibit the content. In fact, if you're comparing content side by side between the phones, the iPhone 12 mini really doesn't cut off much content from the screen at all. You really do get the full experience. And speaking of full experience, Apple has not held back on any of the features on the iPhone 12 mini. You get everything that's great in the iPhone 12 from the upgraded camera systems, that new OLED screen, which looks fantastic. You get that new A14 Bionic processor making this phone super speedy, and you even get 5G. I also haven't even noticed much of a hit on battery life, which is something I was a little bit concerned about given how small the battery in this phone must be, but Apple's A14 processor is super efficient and it really does a good job at lasting the whole day. If I had one complaint about the smaller phone, it wouldn't actually be for content consumption. It's that typing can get a little bit cramped when you're on that smaller screen, but I'm sure that's something that I just have to get used to. I remember typing on the iPhone 5S was completely fine. And so I'm sure that typing on this phone with a little bit of practice will be just as easy. So all in all, the iPhone 12 mini is an incredible phone and at 699, it's a really great value. I think the only other phone that compares to this in terms of value might be the iPhone SE 2. But with this, for 699, you get a flagship phone in a really small package and at a fair price. And so I really don't think you can go wrong with the iPhone 12 mini. Anyway, that's been my unboxing and review of the brand new iPhone 12 mini. If you enjoyed this video, please hit that like button and leave a comment down below letting me know what you think of this tiny phone and if you enjoyed this video and you want to see more of my content make sure to hit that subscribe button because i have a lot of really cool videos coming out soon including the video on this brand new iphone 12 pro max that you'll want to check out anyway that's been it thanks subscribe and peace out i'll catch y'all later Anything.